What's good, guys? If you need cheap, fast, reliable MT, and you are sick and tired of getting scammed by 2K's packs, make sure you hand over to my sponsor. They're running an insane Christmas deal. Use code BUGS for 5% off, or actually 8% off at checkout right now. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Bugs, back on another NBA 2K21 My Team video. And guys, today... Uh, we've been grinding hard. We're going to get Galaxy Opal Dwayne Wade today on stream at around 2 to 3 o'clock Eastern. Uh, before we do get into the video, make sure to smash that like button, drop the sub. It'd be greatly, greatly, greatly appreciated, man. Um, more likes, more subs on the video. I think we actually hit 13,000 subscribers. Let's check the sub count. And did we hit it? We are one sub away from 13,000 subscribers. So if you want you guys could please sum it up. If you guys could please all sum it up, man. Make sure to like this video. Um, we're going to go over the market as per usual. Um, pretty much going to try to help you guys make lots and lots of MT. Today on the stream, we're getting Galaxy Opal Dwayne Wade. So tomorrow or Friday, we're going to focus on limited. We're going to focus on getting RJ. And if you guys do need MT, make sure to hit me up. I am buying and selling MT. Um, if you need MT, man, I'm very reliable. You can hit me up on Instagram or Twitter for prices. Um, links are down below. And you can also follow the new channel because we're about to hit 100 subs on the new trading card channel. Channel as well we do pop a lot of packs on there we're doing my grading order today so it's gonna be cool but yo let's get into the market man let's look at Manu. i saw Manu ginobili at 50k you cannot go wrong with the Manu ginobili for 50k now here's why when idols drops like this one right here this one is a steal i don't know where my Manu is so he has four hall of fame badges mine has three listen to me carefully guys that Manu ginobili i'm buying another one why because bro that first off that car has a shoe it's not a crazy shoe but it, it catches eyes this card has a shoe and it also has an extra hall of fame badge so where the heck is that card uh that one's for 59k with the shoe and a contract like i don't think you go wrong but this one has a shoe and an extra oh wait a second for the extra 4k this has an extra hall of fame badge and so does this one so hot zone hunter oh yeah yeah that's a snag unless they all have hot zone hunter i'm not sure do they Oh my god, so that guy had Hall of Fame Hot Zone Hunter on it. So, you know I'm buying that Mount Ginobili. That is an amazing investment. Once Idols drops, bro, this card is going to go up to 100,000 MT. I hope so. I mean, I invested in him and Dominique Wilkins. I'm really praying this is actually true. Um, I think that makes sense to me. Dominique Wilkins going up a ton. It makes a lot of sense in my opinion, not gonna lie. So, invested in that. We're gonna go over some other investments. Let's check out Hidu. As you guys do know, I did get Hidu Turkaloo. For around uh, 3,500 MT the last couple days, literally yesterday's video. Um, so it looks like Hidu Turkaloo is up to 5,500, 5K, probably 4,900. He's at 5K, almost at 6K. So or 3,500, you sell him for 6K. You're going to make around 2,000 MT profit. That's pretty fire to me, man. 2,000 MT profit. If you got 100, that's 200,000 MT. So you're, you would get 100 for around 30, 350K and you would sell it back for 550K, which is an, an absolute amazing, immaculate W. Um, not only that, guys, if you guys do need Blake, you got to get these challenges done. I got eight left. We're probably going to grind these today on stream. Um, we're also going to try to grind RJ, uh, RJ Barrett. It's so hard to do TTO challenges right now because, man, the sweats are out really trying to get RJ. Uh, if you do any sort of XP, man, it's very hard. But, yo, let's keep it going, man. Let's get into the, uh, one of the best filters in the game. I heard that Pink Diamond Central is a very good filter. And look at this. Giannis, Paul George, Michael Jordan, Derek Rose, Grant Hill. So, um, yeah, this filter is very good. Shout out to my boy EJS. Uh, a ej soul i think um shout out to you bro you're the goat for this one um this one's pretty fire man never know what's gonna pop up on filters you just gotta be a little bit patient but yo this is pretty interesting um not gonna lie right here so pretty cool stuff right here um hopefully you guys could get some snipes in this filter we're also gonna get to the next filter and it is pink diamond small forward minimum buyout now it depends who's up here so now since there is a lot of worthies a lot of have the damn where are these really cheap you could just put this filter to eastern um, so then I think you cannot snipe KD. I'm not sure, but small four picked on Eastern. The only one here is Havlicek. Pretty good filter. You should be able to make lots and lots of MC. Like I was saying, man, this filter's pretty good. It really, you have to be patient on filters, man. The best day to snipe is definitely on Super Packs Day. Um, like if you guys did invest during Super Packs, oh my God, you made a lot of MC, guys. Today, 
Today is honestly a good day to sell. I'm not gonna lie. Today's a very good day to sell. Today is Wednesday. Um, I'm thinking New Year's content maybe tomorrow or the next day. That's what I'm thinking, man. It's getting a little scary here today. Um, content is gonna is gonna come. I think another market crash is coming. So I would sell your cards today. There's definitely a giant giant market crash today. I'm just trying to help you guys make some MT, make some investments. But yo, only problem is with investments on a non-content day is that the market could literally. It can literally just crash right away so that's why i'm kind of iffy on investments um only investment i feel like would be worth it is hero but then again he's in super pack so like it's so hard to read right now i'm super super confused i don't know what i want to do but all i know is that all these investments right here they're gonna stay they're probably gonna drop again and then go back up that's the plan um as you guys do know the new season's around the corner so it's gonna create a lot a lot of tension so since there is going to be a lot of tension, the market will probably drop, I would say, towards the end of the season. I feel like they're, they're probably going to release idol super packs, um, which would be like every idols player in packs. And then a huge market crash is going to happen then because everyone's going to really try to fight for that last card, whether it's Kobe, whether it's LeBron, whether it's Giannis, who knows who it's going to be. But whoever they drop is going to be create a huge, huge market crash. Um, especially, it really depends on that last player. Like... For us, we really got to bank on this last player's got to be goaded. Because if it's not, our Manu investment is going to suck. Because um, if you really think about it, there's really not that many Manus out there. Honestly, if you look at the market, man, there's never a lot of Manus in the market. If you look in like a couple days, you'll probably see no Manus in the market unless they do drop idols tomorrow. Um, let's actually check. So these packs are expired tomorrow. These packs expire tomorrow. But yeah, so these ex all these packs expire besides this one tomorrow which means tomorrow is new year's eve so it looks like we're gonna get content on a thursday um so that pretty much means there's going to be a mega market crash probably tomorrow and or the next day so yeah definitely sell your cards today i'm putting this video out a little early probably like 12 o'clock just so you guys can try and sell your cards today um especially your buyout cards and yesterday i made 50k off shack don't ask me how i don't know how it literally sold for 50k extra but yo guys trust me when i say this man it's time to sell your cards off um i'm gonna show you one more filter before we do in this video and it's pink diamond seasons of giving cheapest um pretty solid filter you never know what's gonna happen so here we go real quick see we get a little snipe this filter is still active because of the locker code so here we go man 37k walter davis is a very good card for 35k like ooh, 39k dirk i don't know if that's a snipe but Definitely keep your eyes on that filter. And yo, that's really all we got for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know if you guys have any market talk questions. Go sub to the new channel. Sub to this channel. We're at 13K almost. Have a good one, boys. Peace.